it's Etienne and um, I'm going to show you how to remove cell phone interference from audio recordings. As you can see, currently I am working on Final Cut Pro. This is for uh, Apple Mac, but I'm dead sure that if you are working on a Windows base, you uh, probably will have an, uh, an audio facility or an audio program that will be able to uh, do pretty much the same as what I'm going to be doing with the audio in Final Cut Pro. The reason I've selected Final Cut Pro for this specific audio is um, because it just it's just easier to work with than, than Logic Pro to remove the stuff so it's a lot more straightforward uh, than it is with, uh, with, with something like Logic or GarageBand. It's literally a couple of clicks and uh, you just pull one of the uh, audio volumes down and then all of a sudden BAM your uh, your uh, your audio is fixed uh, with regards to the cell phone stutter. I'm going to play you the original audio first though. Uh, this is an interview I did with Albert Hammond. The guy sings the Free Electric Band and the Peacemaker. I did it earlier today. Now keeping in mind I didn't do it in a controlled audio environment or a studio environment. Uh, this is uh, what it pretty much sounded like. I did not pick up the cell phone interference until after the interview and then it was too late to call him back for for an interview again but this is pretty much what uh, uh what the interview audio sounds like then uh you have received me with open arms to not become a, i think i might leave it back anyway so that's pretty much what i'm battling with give you a, a clearer indication on on this audio file i'm going to put both of them on five so you can hear it mr hammond hi my name is etienne Louis from the radio station rhg how you doing and i obviously i lived in a, in a very small place called gibraltar now the part of the interview the rest of the interview is fine it's pretty much the first minute and a half that's got that cell phone interference uh, and the first question as well who his inspiration was it sounds like this <laughs> Awesome. Uh, to go back to the beginning, sir, uh, who inspired you? The, 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 the man that I really loved when I was a kid, you know, of eight, seven. Now that is unbroadcastable. You can't broadcast the audio like that. So what you want to do with this is, I'm just going to switch this back to stereo, stereo the way it was when you first load in the audio. What you want to do with this, you're going to have this audio sound like this. So the first thing you do in Final Cut Pro is you say expand audio components right over there. So you right click on the wave and you say expand audio components and you switch that to dual mono and it will give you mono 1 and mono 2 that's pretty much left and right channel. Now if I mute mono 2 you pretty much just get the uh, cell phone interference when I mute mono one. Not a problem. Great. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, great. Yeah. Thank, uh, thank you for the time, Mr. Mr. Hammond. Really appreciate it. Not a problem. Great. Um, I'm. My idol was Buddy Holly. Now, if you uh, put back mono one, come an artist. Um, my idol was Buddy Holly. Um, that that. So if you take that out, mono one note, mono one. My idol was Buddy Holly. Um, that that would. That is pretty much gone. But what you can still do with this, you click on mono two once you've muted mono one completely. It's minus ninety six. So you click on mono two, and you say, uh, give us a bit of vocal enhancement there, plus reduce background noise. To about sixty-five. Um, my idol was Buddy Holly. Uh, that that was the, uh, the, the 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 man that I really loved when I was a kid. You know, of eight. Now, just to indicate the difference to you, when you uh, put back mono one at the same level that. Mono 2 is 12 dB, 12 dB. Um, my idol was Buddy Holly. Uh, that, that was the... So you take out Mono 1 completely. Um, my idol was Buddy Holly. Uh, that, that was the, uh, the, 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 the man that I really loved. 
So as soon as you've done that, you've uh, taken out Mono 1, you go to Share, Master File, Albert Hammond, Edit 4, and you just make sure your settings is on audio only, otherwise you will be saving video and audio, and um, you'll be saving a video file. If you're using it for radio only, you just click Audio, MPEG 3, or you can make your pick there, whichever one you want and uh, you say next and it is saved as a final file. Now like I said this is for Mac users with Final Cut Pro but if you are on Windows uh, I'm sure there are Windows based applications. It works on the same principle you virtually split the two channels into left and right mono 1 and mono 2 as you can see this whole file is dual mono it's not stereo. If I put it on stereo when I was a kid, you know. I'll still have that interference but if I put it on mono in other words, left and right channel, and I mute my left channel, I'll have that. Inspired you to become an artist. That, that was the, uh, the, 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 the man that I really loved when I was a kid, you know, of eight, seven, eight years old. Yeah. Um, and then, uh, you know, then came many others. I mean, you know, there, there was the Everly Brothers. And that's as easy as that, guys. Hope this helps you. Um, like I said, uh, for um, for Windows users, uh, it works on the same principle. Split your audio left to right. Mute the one side that you pick the uh, most static on. Uh, mute that completely. And all you basically do is, uh, when you save it, it'll still save it as a, as a stereo file uh, when, when you save it. It won't save it as a mono. Uh, basically what you're doing is you're just taking out the one channel, the left channel, so it'll save this one then as left and right uh, channel audio, and you'll have perfect audio. You'll get, you'll be rid of that cell phone interference. Hope that hopes this help you, or hope this helps you. Uh, thank you for watching, and um, yeah, cheers. Have a great day.